in the way you define it, I can see how the faithful can work towards a common good. But in our every day, you are in a business world. You are fighting for telcos. Government wants to harass you with taxes. How do you manifest a common good in a situation like that? When the people who have paid you say, we don't want to pay the CST. Government say you have to pay, but don't tell the people you are paying. You, you know what I'm so, in, so maybe that's the challenge for the, the panel now. So how in our individual lives have we tried to champion? Because it's a rich definition, very dense and very loaded. If we are working with this definition, maybe, I, I look, share, how, how are you going to engage and wrap in the common good? For example, in your case, you are dealing with a controversial issue of taxes. The government has a position, your employers <laughs> have a position, the public have a position. Can you arrive at the common good through communication in that sense? Uh, Diana. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Well, I, I, I believe so. I believe so. In, in all of this, um, you need to have the end goal in mind in all the things that you do. And for me, the question to ask me, uh, speaking as a Catholic, is to say what would I do in this particular in the, in the particular case that you find yourself in. And it is in, and as uh, Grace said, in all of the dealings, you also need to consider the other person. So typically in the CST example, so you are collecting a tax that you're doing on behalf of government. So as a bus as business, as industry, we are only agents of the government. And our first intention was that we read the word for that that's how the law said we should do it. And we're very forthright in putting that up. Government says no. He thinks the law should be read in a particular way. But the, the thing about it is that when it comes to tax, we also want to see that you need taxes to be able to develop the country. You know? So definitely, and as, a, as an, um, an organization that operates within the jurisdiction, you need to do it in a particular way. So for us, the common good in this particular way was that, yes, how do we collect the taxes? Two, how do we ensure that the people who, on whose behalf we're collecting this know what we're doing? So you write to government and tell the government that this is what you're going to do. Then the third one is also the people who you're going to be collecting the tax for. So for us, I take you very clear. Let us be very transparent with them and let them know that this is how it's going to be done. For the industry itself, the other angle was that how do we do it in such a way that tomorrow, if government comes in and says, I have reduced the taxes, it's easy for you to just do it. So that mode of implementation has to take all of this into consideration so that in every decision that you take, I, I agree that it's difficult because sometimes, paradoxically, you could be pulled in various directions. But you need to stand true to and say, the, the, at the position that I am at, what is it that I have, I've got to do? And mm. typically so that's, that's let me give an example. I, I tried to get Ken to come for an interview on this issue, and I was unsuccessful. And I guess your solution to the controversy was silent. So the question is, was that because that was, that was the best way to satisfy the common good? Yes, so in, 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 in a particular situation like this, and when I was sure, I, he called me severally. But the point you wanted to do was that you also wanted to give respect to the people you were talking to. So once you were engaging the government to be able to, to deal with the situation, that was not the time to now come in into the public to come and discuss what it is like you were doing. You know, so you wanted to have that respect for the people that you're having the discussion with, but you were clear in your mind that in everything that you do, so far as the consumer, the citizens were concerned, you definitely had to come back again to them to be able to tell them what it is that you're doing. So, and the conversation at the table was that once all of us finish that, they would issue a joint statement. Wow. So, so silence can be a great it's communication. tool of communication exactly. for the common good. Especially <laughs> at, at the particular time. Wow.